so we got this one on this side this panel and I still got to fix that on the bottom um, so now what we're doing is going to come over on this side on the other side here and work on this curved and I'm going to bring this piece from here all the way around to here, I think. From here all the way around to here. I think that's what I want to do. I may overlap it on the front here. Um, Um, yeah, I may overlap it on the front only because I've got this uh, little short thing there. I'd rather it be wider. So what I may do is bring this piece to here and then this front piece right here over to here. Yeah, I think that's what I'm going to do. So, if we measure, if I hold it up here and measure, we're looking at about 10 inches. So, so we're looking at about 10 inches. So, I'm going to measure this from here over to here and cut it straight down. All right. What I've done here is... Um, I've cut these pieces and they're gonna go here, right there, but they're gonna overlap so that there's no gap there. I first did it to where there was a gap and I didn't like it. So I cut some more pieces that I had and I had to cut it out around these because it was so eat up around it. And this thing actually went in this way some more because the piece that goes in the middle is not big enough to go all the way across it. So I'm going to have to cut a piece out of that other stuff that I got that didn't come with this. Um, and it, it was just so eat up that, you know, it, was, it wouldn't have been solid pieces there. So... I've got both sides cut. I've got to, I've still got to cut the bottom piece here and put that in before I can put this side on. But I'm going to have to drill these back out on both sides to overlap it. But that's okay. It's no big deal. Uh, but once I do that, I can put these on. This one is out of the bent part of the other one. You see how it's already curved a little bit. The other one's a flat piece because I cut the first one over there that was on the curve and it was, and it, I cut it short and I didn't like it. So I redid it. So all of them, all the pieces I'm going to have overlap. That way there's no, there's no gap there because it just didn't look very good. And then this one I'll cut a piece down there. So, yeah. So that's what I've been working on trying to get that finished up I may end up taking this once I get this done I may end up taking this and um, taking it off with the tractor and setting it aside I hadn't decided yet but I still have to weld some more on here and on the underside of this I got to make some templates for this though uh, to finish this off and once I do that, then I can weld these on. That'll be done. And then weld the bottom parts. And I, and I may have to use the tractor to pick it up on its side. or That way I can get to it easier. I don't know. I hadn't decided what I'm going to do. It. I don't know. If I'm, my tractor may not may be too heavy, with the, even with the bed off it might be too heavy 
for that tractor. I don't know, but we'll uh, cross that bridge when we get there. Maybe if I take some of this stuff off, I could take the rear axle back out and uh, and then it would lighten the load a good bit, but we'll see. All right, I made me a template out of cardboard. Um, so it is a specific shape that I made and it's the width of this too. So it kind of fits right there and it molds around this. Um, what I'm gonna have to do is just get some eighth inch plate, cut it to this shape, and then heat it with a torch. Probably, probably weld it here heat it with a torch to get it red hot, hammer it, in, hammer it in place, weld it along the bottom, and then heat it and weld it as I go on the bottom and top, and heat it and weld it. You know, I'm gonna drill some holes in here to help hold it also. And then this should be, this will be the last piece I put on, on both sides to help hold it to the frame I think that's probably overkill but it will make me feel better I don't think I need that but again <clears throat> it would make me feel better so maybe that's probably what I'm going to do. But anyway, um, I still got to get some material to make it work. So, but that's what we got going on. Uh, that's all I'm going to do tonight. We'll get back on her tomorrow. And hopefully all these pieces will be dry. I can paint them back, paint the back and put them on and start finishing up the bed. It's... It's getting there. The wood, I still got to put wood and stuff in there, but I'm going to do that later. So, there we go. All right, what we're going to do here is this edge right here is got, is bad. It's, it's not cut good. It's not cut straight. So, I'm going to make a straight edge. I'm going to cut off uh, some of this to make it usable. So I got, I'm gonna put this long straight edge on here and draw a line on it. So that I can cut it. Yeah, some of that's not very straight. I'm going to try and hammer it down some to where it has a little bit of a straightness to it. do it you have to just do it like that
Wow, I know that. Let's see how that works. Try and make that work. That's better than it was. It's a lot better than it was. Now I think I need I think I did ten and a half inches o overlap. Go ten and a half. Ten and a half. that piece. Now I need to cut the ends off square. Now let's cut the ends off square. Um, I'm going to do that. Then I'm going to use this as a straight edge. Even though it's probably not square, but it's probably close. It's probably close. If I line this up on the edge, it should. It should be good enough. Hmm. 
Yeah, it's not it's not square, is it? No. Uh no. But that's okay. That's okay. Let's see how long we need it. We need it. We need it. About 78 and a quarter. Yeah, about. Try this again. Nope, 78 exactly. 78. I don't think this is even close. It is not. Okay. It's all right. Um, that other one, it might be, it might be actually different over here on this side. It is not. It's 78. So that's good. Good news. Now, we come over here to this. Forty-one. If I cut a piece forty-one. Actually, well, it's going to be. I wonder if uh, I wonder if I can cut it. I wonder if I can cut it right there. Sixty-three and three quarters. Sixty-three and three quarters. Hmm. Okay, have measured, and I'm going to mark. So I don't have a piece long enough to go all the way across the back like I did on this side. So I'm going to have to piece it. We go. So that's good news. Now that that's completed, I think I'm gonna try to do it. I'm hanging this up, and I'll show you in a minute. hanging this up so it'll so 
so it'll stay up here and uh, Um, I did this once before, but I'm not so sure I'm going to be able to do it now, again. Mm -mm. I don't think so. I don't think so. But we're going to try it anyway. I'm going to try something a little different here. Let's try that, shall we? We'll see how I got that kind of uh, on there. I'm, I'm extending my legs on my tripod so it'll stand up again. Sorry about that. Don't don't inhale that stuff. It's not good for you. It's bad. It's bad news. It's bad news. Okay, I sprayed her down <clears throat> with that uh, Osfo, and uh, I let her drip dry. And when that's ready to go, uh, we can put her in. I've got to uh, make a some shorter piece for that too. And I'll do that. All right, guys. <clears throat> you can see here that I've got the um, the side and this front curve piece. I've got this all the way down, riveted all the way down here the bottom and I've got it clamped right here the problem is, is I got to put a piece in under here um, and I can't I can't rivet that yet now I could drill it this is probably what I'm going to do is I'm probably going to drill it and the reason why I'm gonna do that is that way when I pull it back over, I can hit that same hole and I know I'm in, this, in the right spot. I know this will be tight. Um, and it is tight. It is, you can see right there that it, it bends around that good. Um, so, I'm okay with that so uh, yeah I'll probably drill them and then when I get it over I'll know I'll hit the right the same spot hopefully this will might make this relax some I don't know probably it, it may or may not who knows but um, it's pretty pretty solid um, so I'm gonna do that and on the other side and I'm gonna, I'm gonna film the other side and I'll show you guys what I did on the other side uh, when I get to it. All right, I got uh, I got that temporary the bottom piece temporarily on. I got those uh, rivets drilled back out, and I'm gonna put this on. 
Got this, and we'll put on. I got that, let me go get my tool. Should be ready now. <laughs> 